Hi there, my name's Andy Hillier, and today's guitar lesson is going to be on the awesome new track by Muse called Will of the People. I'm going to teach you the whole song, but just before I do, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video, and I'd love to hear from you as well, so please leave me some comments in the comment section, including what songs I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing, and you want to support me, support the channel, and you want to print the tabs off for this, I'll put them on my Patreon page, I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Uh, we've got four lines of music that we need to learn, so it's not too much. Uh, the first bit, the intro, it starts off with like the vocal, um, and then we come in with a guitar just going. So for that, all we're doing is literally resting your hands, probably around the third fret, because if you go too, too high up, it gives a different tone, but about the third fret, and you just touch the strings gently um, so that it stops them ringing. So we get these percussive hits. And all you can do is go down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, all the way through uh, until the very last hit of the fourth bar, you're gonna play E5. So you need to get the And that's the first line of music, pretty straightforward. That takes us to the verse. So we've already hit the five from the previous bar. And then you're just gonna do two bars of the percussive hits. So you go. And then you're gonna hit that five again, E5. And then another E5. Don't play the note in the brackets, that's just held on from the previous um, bar. So you've got two E5s, then E8, e, uh, then onto the A string and play A4, and then A5. So you've got... A bit faster. And the speed of it. And then you play the open E string, and then another open E, then E3, E4, and the E5. If we just go from those open E's, they go. Slowly, that'd be. And then the five at the end, uh, the E5, is where it's gonna repeat back to the beginning of the line. So let's kind of start on that last note, and it's gonna repeat back, so we're gonna play the whole line. So E5, and then play the whole line, ready? Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, so that repeats round the verse. So you play the whole line, uh, it's over twice or four times round. Uh, and then we get a bridge which goes. So to play that, open E string. Um, and I like to use down and up straight. So you, I go down, up, up, down, up, 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 up. So you go down, up, up, down, up, 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 up. And then we play A5, then A4. So the first two bars slowly, you go. And then the next bars, 12 and 13, same thing, but instead of playing a5 to A4 at the end, it goes A5 up to A6. So let's play bars 12 and 13, you got. So let's play bars 10, 11, 12 and 13, here we go. It then repeats back and plays bars 10, 11 and 12 but you don't play bar 13 on the second time round, you just play bar 14, which is just two E's uh, on the open string. Okay, so the second time through, let's play this, 10, 11, 12, and then jump to 14, and you get. Okay. 
Which then takes us to the chorus, which is kind of the same riff, it goes. <laughs> So you play E5 twice, E8, A4, then A5. So you've got two open E's, E3, E4, E5. So from the beginning you've got. And then it plays a five at the end of that bar, bar 16. And then it's, the next bar is exactly the same, it's kind of like repeating, but you've just got that extra five before it says. Uh, playing the last five of bar 16, you get. And then there's no five at the end of that um, line, and it, that, then that whole line will repeat. So if we play that whole line, it goes like this. And that just repeats um, for the chorus, then it goes back to the verse, bridge, and then choruses till the end of the song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. It's a great fun song to play. If you have enjoyed the lesson, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, it really does help me out. Give me a like on the video, uh, and I'd love to hear from you, so please leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know where in the world you're from, what you thought of the video, uh, what songs I should do next, what you think of the new song by Muse as well. And if you love what I'm doing and you want to support me, support the channel and you want to print the tabs off of this, then I'll put it on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. Well, thanks for watching this. I've been Andy Hillier and I'll see you next time.